Emperor's army. The Great Wall of China. Follow! I could get used to this. Look, English officers! What's the British Navy doing here? They could help me find my father. No, Bridie. They'll send me straight back to the reformatory. Not if I tell them that you're... What will you tell them, Bridie? I'd tell them that you were brave. Brighty, you can't tell them anything about me. Sam, I have to do something. Forward! Too late, anyway. I'll see the Emperor immediately. Wait here. So, nephew, you've got the British Navy to fight your battles. The old ways are past, aunt. No, they are not. I will deal with the army, aunt. You attend to your affairs. And if you do happen to find the secret of eternal life, you must let me know. Oh, you're mocking me. Who is that? What? Oh, he's nobody. Away from here. Go on. Tell me of these ridiculous plans of yours. I am your aunt, the empress. I have a right to know. I'm not a nobody. Me neither. Silence. We'll never get father free from those rebels. When our army wins, my aunt will find your father. Your aunt isn't interested in Bridie's father. Or anyone except herself. Yes, you're right. I'm sorry. That boy must stay near me at all times. You've got to come. Bridie, if I can get Swoop out of the cage, I'm going to try and get to the sea. Will you come with me? I'll never see my father again. <laughs> I don't know what else to do, Brian. Well, Mr. Parkinson, you still reckon the Emperor hasn't got any defences? Button your lip, Donahue. Those British gunners are too accurate. Did we, Mr. Parkinson? Come on, lads! Forward! I've got an idea. There's no time for games, Donahue. No game, just using the old brain. The British Marines haven't got a clue who we are, right? I suppose so. The rebels are finished! Keep up! Help! Help! Cut us loose! Fly me! It's your lucky day! One of those rebels didn't finish you off. Oh, bless you. We're just merchants in the wrong place at the wrong time. Well, muster on the beach with the other civilians. You're safe now. Mm, nice work, Tom. All salute our glorious emperor and his great victory over the rebel army. And our allies, the British Navy. This finishes and everyone starts moving. I'm gonna try and get Swoop. If I do, don't forget we run that way. Ow! I'm scared, Sam. So am I. Her most glorious and beneficent Victoria Regina, monarch and ruler of the Kingdom of England, of Wales and of Scotland, and of far-flung dominions, principalities, territories, and their annexures, forming that great and potent Father! entity, the British Empire, Brody! bestow her benefits, blessings, and gratitude, in total your... present and future... Jane? Let me go! Let go! I've only just begun my speech. Young! Sam! Young! This is the Young who knows about the dragon? Aunt, this is intolerable. Those foreigners and that one, bring them now. It can't be. What? It's my brother. My very own brother, Sam. It's impossible. Say nothing. But you told the foreign boy you saw the dragon. Your greatness, I... Uh... I am a foolish, prattling old man. I have spoken fables to the child. Please, rise, old man. You've done well. 
You mustn't fear me. I, I wish you only good. Now, come along. I've prepared a feast for you and your friends. Take this creature and return it to the Round Eye Boy. He's protected and honoured the bones of your beloved brother and deserves a reward. I don't want you getting any ideas, Parkinson. I don't want my little brother hurt. That brother of yours is something of a favourite with the mad dragon woman. We could use that. I don't know how or why Sam got here, but he could get killed if we do something stupid. I say we leave. And I say we stay and seek our fortune here. Or else certain English officers might like to know certain things. Hmm? I don't know how Bridie did it. She's pretty good, Captain Billy. For a girl. What's your step, boy? <laughs> <laughs> well, we sail tomorrow. So we have to say farewell to our friends, Tom, Tan. I hope we meet again. And, well, I want a toast to that. And I cannot express what is in my heart for all that these children have done in, in keeping the bones of my brother through all their trials. Gladly, I drink to our everlasting friendship. Brighton? Ted? What's going on? Oh, <laughs>